Welcome to Pharmacology Outline Channel. Today, we will discuss enzyme-linked receptors, a crucial class of cell surface receptors that play a significant role in signal transduction and drug development. Let's start with the basics. Enzyme-linked receptors, also known as catalytic receptors, are transmembrane proteins with an extracellular ligand binding domain and an intracellular enzymatic domain. Unlike G-protein-coupled receptors, which rely on secondary messengers, enzyme-linked receptors directly initiate a cascade of intracellular signaling upon activation. There are several types of enzyme-linked receptors, but the most prominent are receptor tyrosine kinases, receptor serine, threonine kinases, and guanylyl cyclase-linked receptors. Among these, receptor tyrosine kinases are the most well-studied and clinically relevant, especially in oncology and metabolic disorders. Examples of enzyme-linked receptors include insulin receptor, regulates glucose homeostasis, epidermal growth factor receptor, involved in cell growth and implicated in cancer, vascular endothelial growth factor receptor, plays a role in angiogenesis. Now, Let's discuss the mechanism of activation. When a ligand binds to the extracellular domain of a receptor tyrosine kinase, receptor dimerization occurs, leading to autophosphorylation of tyrosine residues in the intracellular domain. This phosphorylation serves as a docking site for signaling proteins, initiating pathways like the MAPK and PI3K AKT pathways crucial for cell proliferation and survival. Given their critical role in cell regulation, dysregulation of enzyme-linked receptors is linked to various diseases, particularly cancer. Overexpression or mutations in receptors like epidermal growth factor receptor and HER2 have been implicated in malignancies, making them prime targets for pharmacological intervention. Several drugs have been developed to target these receptors, including monoclonal antibodies, for example, trastuzumab for HER2-positive breast cancer, tyrosine kinase inhibitors, for example, imatinib for chronic myeloid leukemia. These therapeutics work by either blocking ligand binding, preventing dimerization, or inhibiting kinase activity to halt aberrant signaling. In conclusion, Enzyme-linked receptors are vital to cellular communication and a key focus in pharmacology, particularly in cancer and metabolic disease treatment. Understanding their function paves the way for innovative drug discovery and precision medicine. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe for more pharmacology insights. Hit the bell to stay updated. Keep learning!